Good morning, love bug. We're making tea. First, the water. Okay. Start. So it's 175 degrees for green tea. Between like 170, 180. So 175. And then my tea bag, which it is. I have one, one tea bag. And then for my, you have to calculate how much for if you're doing my tea. So you just have to calculate how much tea that for the water. And it's, let's see, 64 ounces, eight cups, two liters. So two, I have two liters and I use two ounces. That's a lot. So for you, it would be half that. So it would be an ounce or two big heaping tablespoons. Okay, next up, matcha. Okay, so one scoop of matcha. Matcha, green matcha. Bring it over here. <laughs> okay, so this is washed and all ready to go. So I just put a little hot water on it so it stays hot. So here we go. Fill this whole thing, which is basically half a gallon, two liters. And then put your timer on, three minutes. Okay, and then you kind of like absorb the tea. So I pop it up and down to make it make sure that it absorbs all the tea leaves and then okay three minutes and in between i pour a little bit of water just a little bit <clears throat> you don't want us to splash and then i start whisking Hi. Isn't fun? i'm gonna see you on thursday okay so just get all the little chunks out it's bright green. It should be like neon green. You're supposed to go in like a little H form to make the foam. See how it's foaming? You can go crazy. Like that. And then go around the edges. Okay, so it's nice and wet. There's no foamy. And there's no clumps. I don't want any clumps. Actually, people that do matcha they sift it first but i don't because i can get all the lumps out okay up and down tea so the longer you let it sit the more the tannic acids come out and the more bitter it will be or if your water is super hot it will burn it and make and bring out that tannic acid and have that have that like acid like um and so this you want it you want to do between like two and three minutes and then it's a little sweeter. The tannic acid is not bad, but it makes it more bitter. It just doesn't taste good. That's all. Okay. So now that's, I have, I have like a minute and a half. So then I bring out all my stuff. Cacao, coconut, mushrooms. I use bulletproof creamer sometimes. Great, super greens, moringa. Cholera. Did we figure out how to pronounce that? Cholera. And then I got this. This is spirulina. Check this out. This is bright blue spirulina. Crazy. And green spirulina. Okay. So here we go. Cook it. One. This is what I use. I use like a big old, it's like a basically a big old tablespoon. Here. Coffee and waffle. <laughs> Fit and lean. <laughs> okay, okay, that was one, two, and three. Oops. Okay, so that goes in here. 
Okay, so we've done one. Now cacao. So I do two things. So I put it in here. I do, I put it in here in my mug. That's my first tea drink. And then I put this, the whole thing in the tea. Um, uh, the thermos. What is this? Okay, moringa. So I put like a scoop of moringa in here, a scoop of moringa in here. And then <laughs> greens, super greens. I'm generous with super greens. Scoop and a scoop, big scoop. Super greens. For Elena. It's really not, I do one. I put a, teen, a little bit in here and then the rest in here. So I just do one of spirulina. And then super blue spirulina. I That's do like blue spirulina. A half. Crazy. I know. It's really good. Okay, and then I just do like a half a scoop. I split that in both. Okay. Mushrooms. I do like a scoop and a scoop. Cholera, cholera helps you detox, so I do one and one. It helps you chelate too, so I do a lot of that. Okay, matcha's done. And then sometimes I put bulletproof creamer just for, I don't know, the body of it. So then I do a little scoop in each, like, or a half a scoop. Okay, voila. And then, Okay. We'll clean that mess up later. Okay, so I have two things, my coffee mug, and then this all goes into the thermos. Okay, my bag of tea is done. So I put that into the green waste over here. Okay, here's the honey. The honey! And refill. Okay. One. And then don't get my spoon wet because I don't want the tea water in here. So that's one. And then two. So that's a big old honking tablespoon. And that's it for the whole thermos and for this. So really that's not bad. That's my own sh only sugar. And it makes all the difference in the world for taste. So the honey is off. So then I shake it once. I shake the honey in it. Shake it. Feels good on my back. You want some fries with that shake? Okay. So here is the tea with honey. Then I add, I get the matcha off my, I don't want to waste any matcha. So I get that off and I pour the matcha in here and get the rest of the matcha. So I pour all the matcha in my tea. So now it's tea, honey, and matcha. And sometimes I just taste the tea by itself and then I taste the, the tea and the matcha together before I put all the, the mud in it. Okay. When you shake it, you have to kind of depressurize it. So here is just straight matcha and tea. This is awesome, just the way it is. So then I take one. So this is just thin green tea, which is good. That's awesome. Okay, so now I save a little bit of tea in here. Okay, voila. First thing, I take this straight tea and I put it in, in here. And I leave a little space for milk. And then I take this whole thing, check that out. It's like one of those little sand colored art pieces, except messy. And then I dump it in here. 
carefully. So I save a little tea because then I want to get everything off the edges. Okay, all my spirulina. Okay, now it's shake time. Okay, so here's my mud. There's my mud. Keep it warm. Okay, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Ugh. Look, it's a cart. It's my favorite. Okay. Now, now we got mud in the tea. Okay, now I just add milk and voila. So I always heat up my milk because otherwise it makes your tea cold and that's. So I heat it up just. Don't want to boil it. So that's my flax, this is my flax milk. So then, I actually, sometimes I just drink it straight. Okay, so I pour some out just because I like it without milk sometimes, a little bit. And then this makes it into a meal. So I pour most of the milk in here. Again, reshake. Are we done? I love you. That's tea by L Star.